Hi everyone and welcome to my Sathvik kitchen. The spicy chickpea and avocado toast topped with a crunchy kachumbur salad is going to rock your world. I quite literally make this toast a couple of times a week. It's simple, nourishing, packed with so much flavor and is perfect for breakfast, lunch or a light dinner. Let's go. Add some butter to a heavy bottom pan. Once heated, add in the onions and garlic and sauté until fragrant. Next, add in the boiled chickpeas and stir well. Time to add some spices. In goes some chili flakes, paprika powder, salt to taste, roasted cumin powder, and dried pomegranate seed powder. Stir well until the chickpeas are well combined with the rest of the spices. Add in some green chilies that's totally optional. Some green onions and give it all a good mix. I'm adding just a little bit of water to avoid the spices from burning. Now using a spatula gently mash some of the chickpeas. It'll give the chickpeas a nice and creamy texture and we want the chickpeas to be slightly tender but not mushy. In goes some fresh herbs. I'm adding coriander and mint leaves. Mix well. Turn the stove off. Add in some lemon juice. Give it a final mix and the chickpeas are ready. For the kachumbur salad, I've taken some finely chopped cucumbers, tomatoes, radish, green onions and red onions. Add some fresh herbs. I'm using mint and coriander. Drizzle just a little bit of olive oil. Salt to taste. Roasted cumin powder. Chaat masala. And lemon juice. Mix well and keep it aside. Cut the avocado into half. Remove the pits from the avocado and discard. Scoop out the avocado flesh with a spoon and place into a medium bowl. Mash with a fork. Season with salt and just a little bit of lemon juice. Mix well and let's get ready to assemble. Drizzle some olive oil and toast your bread until golden brown. I've used rye bread, but you can use any bread of choice. Spread the smashed avocado onto your toast. Top with the spicy chickpea mix. A good amount of crunchy and tangy kachumbur salad. Some microgreens. And dig in and enjoy every single bite. For more such recipes, don't forget to like, follow and subscribe.